today I'm going to talk about my negative experiences in music, why I have dreaded composing so often for the last year, and why I don't have plans to continue composing anytime soon. This is not a clickbait video like this one, so let's get started. My second major was in math, and I can easily say that majoring in music composition was much more stressful and draining. And here's why. In almost any subject besides music, there are very tangible assignments, assessments, and milestones. Once you finish a final exam, you have completed that class. And once you finish a class or pass a test, it's pretty easy to confidently say that you feel like you've mastered the material. In music, you will never feel like that. You can always be composing more. You can always be practicing more. And honestly, when I was in college, I would find myself really dreading my summer, winter, and and spring breaks because I knew I would be home with my family, but I would feel guilty about spending time with them because I felt like I needed to be doing more music. I never really felt that kind of pressure in other subjects because you don't have projects or assignments to finish over break. And you don't exactly have mandatory music assignments over break either, but you do have a lesson the first week back from break and you have to have something to present in your first lesson. And I also want to mention that the grades that I got in my music classes were generally much higher than the grades I got in my other classes. In fact, I think most people at Bean In would agree that in music classes, grades are inflated, but it's not about the grades in music. And I think that's partially why it has been so stressful for me. Another thing I want to address is why majoring in music composition specifically, not just music, is so difficult. I would say majoring in music performance is a lot like majoring in history. Everything is already written. It is just your job to study the material and regurgitate it. Mind-numbingly boring. To me. Composing is not at all like history in this way. There are very few rules. So I would say composing is more like creative writing. You get into it because you have all these ideas and emotions that you want to convey. You have these wild bursts of inspiration where you turn out so much quality material, but then you'll also face these periods of writer's block. And as a music composition major, I quickly got to a point where I realized that in order to be successful, in order to meet deadlines, I couldn't keep writing on emotion and inspiration. I was frequently uninspired and unmotivated, but I still needed to produce material, either for a class, a lesson, a film director, or some other project. So by necessity, I learned to compose in a way that was very mechanical, and I refined that process to a point where I was writing music very effectively and efficiently. I felt very happy and proud when I finished a project, but I started to notice that I only felt that happiness towards the ends of projects. I was not enjoying the process. It didn't feel like I was using a talent. It felt like I was developing a very niche skill. And when I composed like this, I was able to write so much music. In just four years of college, I composed the music for 10 films. I wrote concert music for string quartets, wind ensembles, eclectic chamber groups, soloists, you name it. I also sang, wrote, and produced several pop songs using technology that I was completely unfamiliar with in high school. And I don't want to diminish my college experience at all. It was such an enriching and rewarding experience. I am so grateful for all the resources I was able to take advantage of as a music student. But one month after graduating, I truly have no desire to compose. And to be honest, in the last year, I have not had much desire to compose either. So what's next, you may ask? Last fall, I signed a job offer with an economic consulting firm in Chicago that I am very excited about. And as far as my musical future? Well, I've also been giving composition lessons for over a year now and I really enjoy doing that, so I am going to continue doing that. I also want to say that I still love to experience music in many ways other than through composition. I absolutely love dancing to music, I love listening to music, and I do both almost every day. I also believe there will be a time when the world is no longer in such chaos, and I may start composing again, but it will probably not be for a while. I will definitely still be coming out with some more videos related to music because it is pretty fun to create stupid videos like this. I am also a bit of a music theory nerd, so I might create some score analysis videos. Anyways, thank you for listening. As always, I am happy to answer any of your questions related to majoring in music or whatever else. You can contact me in the comments or email me. That is it for today. Have a lovely day. Bye.